Hey, what's up, you guys? Super Mario Studios 1990 here, and today, um, I got sad news to tell y'all. I'm gonna have to quit YouTube. You know, I mean, it's because that <laughs> this will be the last video that will be made. So, I'm sorry. I'll have to quit YouTube for a while, guys. <laughs> gotcha guys april fools <laughs> nah seriously guys i'll be going back to making videos once you know guys uh as you remember my announcement video i said that i have to take a break for a moment because i have a lot of school i need to do guys i mean i'm close to graduating high school guys so yeah but no worries more new videos might come out in the summer once i graduate high school guys so, also can't forget, today is my four year anniversary as well. I've it's been like, you know, four years being on YouTube. Like, it's really great. And for this time, I actually thought of, you know, where's the Snatcher trailer gonna be coming out? Not sure yet, since I still need to hire some voice actors, you know, for my characters that I got. So, ugh, you might have to wait a bit longer. So, to complete this four year anniversary special will be about an alternate universe of me. Like, you know, what would my life be like if I was in college? So, yeah. Let's get to the video. Sliding now. Oh man, I don't want to be late for my third year of college. All right, I'm about to head off to my first period. Hello! Whoa! Oh! Sorry about that, I'm scaring you. Whoa, uh, uh, who are you? Oh, I'm Mario. And you are? Uh, uh Smart Studios. Ah! Are you here in college? Uh, yeah, this is my, uh, uh third year. Oh, that's interesting, you know, because I'm here studying another time, actually. Wait, you came here to college? Yeah, I graduated as a technician, you know, for plumbing. But now I'm here again to study to be a doctor. Wow. Wait, I also got one thing to ask you. Yes, go ahead. So what is making you want to study to be a doctor? Oh, I just want to help out people. Hmm, that is a valid reason why people want to be doctors, you know? Yeah, oh, I also have a brother named Luigi. Oh, really? Yeah, you'll like him. He's pretty kind of scared at times, but 
He's really good to get to know. Oh, okay. I don't want to be late for my first period. Oh, what are you having for first period? Uh, some kind of like Japanese lessons. Oh, that's right. On my portfolio, I also applied for Japanese lessons. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, we should go. All right, let's go. So, when is your brother Luigi gonna be coming here? Oh, in a moment. Sometimes he might run in a bit late. Hmm. But why would he run in a bit late? Well, it's usually from helping people. Right? You kidding me? That is not a valid reason to be late. I know, but sometimes he has to run a bit late. But still, it's not fair that they shouldn't mark him absent for attendance. Well, I'm sorry. That's just how life works. Well, you are right, so. Hey, Mario. Oh, here comes my brother Luigi. Hey, Mario. Oh, hey, Luigi. Oh, hey, and who is this right here, Mario? Oh, hello, my name is Sumari Studios. Oh, hello, my name is Luigi. Luigi Mario. Wait, what? Your last name is Mario? Yeah, isn't that kind of, like, you know, what do you find it as? I don't know, like strange. I mean, like, what is Mario's last name? Oh, my last name is Mario as well. Wait, wait, hold up. You're Mario Mario? Well, yeah. Oh my gosh. How can you have the same last name, guys? You know, what do you mean by that? Like, you know, you have the... Mario has his uh, same first name having... The same last name, like you know, Mario Mario, and then you being Luigi Mario. Well, I'm not sure about that. Why? Yeah, this is kind of confusing. But, anyways, what are you here for college for? Well, I came to study linguistics here. But my actual dream is to be a voice actor and a voice director. Oh, really? So, when I ran into Mario here, uh, he told me he came to study here again as a doctor. Oh yeah, it's true. Mario actually wants to be a doctor while I myself am just here to get a degree in plumbing. Really? Yup. Wow. And anyways, what is this lecture about? Oh, this is the Japanese lecture. Oh, I also applied for Japanese lessons here. Oh, really? Yeah. Then you should all be here with us. Oh, yeah. Time to take this lecture to all of the three of us. So, Summer Studios, we got questions to ask you. Oh yeah? What is it? What are your interests? Like, we are very curious what your interests are. Yeah, we won't judge you if you tell us. Well, okay, so here's how it works. My interests, which uh, they include, how do I explain it? Well, what is your favorite show? Well, one show I'm a huge fan of is Bluey. Wait, but why Bluey? Yeah, isn't that show for like children? What are you talking about? In recent times, the show is now becoming more popular with adults who don't have children. Like how? Well, by teaching dark subjects. Dark subjects like what? Like death, someone being infertile, how people were created having a father in the military, etc. Oh, so that explains why I've seen adults been watching Bluey. Yeah, that's right. I've seen adults watch Bluey. Did I just hear y'all talk about Bluey? Oh, uh, who's that over there? Oh, that's our friend Parappa. Hey, yo, I hear y'all talking about Bluey. Why, yes, Parappa. Our friend here in Sumai Studios is talking about Bluey. Oh, really? Nice to meet you. My name is Parappa. Oh, well, my name is Sumar Studios. So, I hear you all talking about Bluey? Well, not really. What are you talking about, Luigi? Of course we are. Sumar Studios is the one talking to us. Oh, right. I like Bluey too, Sumar Studios. Wait, really? Yeah. I mean, for also how, you know, like, dark subjects about it, like, that is actually the reason why Bluey seems like it's more geared toward adults. Well, I mean, there are some things that adults see that children do not notice. Yeah, I know. Oh, uh, yup. 
You guys are all talking about Bluey over there? Oh, it's Banjo! Oh, Banjo? Uh, oh, the talking bear and bird. They're right there. Wait, why is there a bear and a bird here? Oh, that's just our friends, Banjo and Kazooie. We've known them for a long time. The uh -huh. Oh, hey, welcome here, Banjo. Whoa, that is nice. Well, thank you. Bear and bird go together together. I'm not sure if that's really a saying, but okay. So, uh, Mario, Luigi, Parappa, who is this? Yeah, like, who is this? Oh, this is our friend, Super Mario Studios. Hello, it's nice to meet you, Banjo. Oh, uh -huh. it's nice to meet you as well. So, I hear y'all talking about Bluey? Yeah, why? Oh, both Kazooie and I love Bluey. Oh, really? Yeah. I mean, we like what they have. Like, for me, I like it's because of the bin birds. Oh, you mean those weird pelican, whatever you call them? Yeah, those Australian birds. I don't get why they call them bin birds. But do you often get, uh, like, you know, confused by what they're saying? Oh, uh yeah. -huh. Sometimes, like, how they're calling, like, you know, french fries as chips and then chips as chips. Yeah, I mean, first of all, you got the UK. They call fries chips and they call chips crisps. Yeah, I don't get why. Yeah. <laughs> but <sighs> I kind of hate it when Disney censors Bluey. I know, right? Yeah, that's a problem. Yeah, I know. And only 129 episodes are on Disney+. Plus. Oh, yeah. I've seen all 141. Wait, what? You see all 141 episodes? Yeah. Specifically ones where they're uncensored? I know, right. Oh, yeah. It's true to my studios? Yeah, I've seen all episodes uncensored. Oh. I see what you're talking about, you know? How Disney is one to censor some stuff, like... Getting hit in the groin and then bandit saying groin. Oh yeah, and there's also the horse pooping as well. I know, some stuff that might be suitable for children in Australia, but they might be unsuitable for children internationally. I know, that's pretty strange. Shall we keep talking about Bluey somewhere else? Yeah, it sounds like a good idea. Alright, let's go. Cause only let's fly. <laughs> what was that? Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you! Banjo can actually fly with Kazooie behind him! I know, that's really cool, right? Yeah, that is so cool! Should we get to where we can talk about Bluey somewhere else? Ah, uh, yeah, right! I'm about to get going! Alright, so many videos! We'll see you there! Yeah, alright, we'll see ya! See ya! Alright, time to get going! You know, it's so great that we found a spot so we can talk about Bluey! I know, right? And we got other people that are right next to us. Yeah, they're talking about their own stuff. So, yeah. Let's keep talking about Bluey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold up. Did I hear you talk about Bluey? Oh, it's Sonic. Oh, really? Yeah. I mean, he claims that he's better than us because he's faster than us. Yeah. But, the truth is, his company, Sega, I mean, you got Mario and Luigi, they're, they're Nintendo, and I'm Sony, myself. Uh, uh, yeah? you're actually part of na 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 Oncha? Oh, right. That is a developer for PlayStation. And Banjo and I are from Rare, which, originally we were from Nintendo, but we were later bought out by Microsoft. Oh. Yeah, Sonic's company only develops games now. Oh yeah, I heard in the earlier days they used to make hardware. Yeah, they used to make hardware, but it wasn't until the 2000s came, and then Sega stopped making hardware. But, the rivalry between Sonic and I have ended. Ah, that's good to hear. So, Sonic is coming here right now. Yo, did I hear y'all talking about Bluey? Uh, yeah, we are talking about Bluey. Oh, right. I'm blue just like Bluey is. Oh, yeah. 
We forgot about that! You're blue! Yeah, just like Bluey is. I mean, I like all about the dark topics of Bluey. Oh, really? Yeah, the dark topics are pretty interesting. Like, you know, even though children are too young to hear them, it somehow might be a great way for adults to understand that Bluey is actually relatable to real life. I know, right? It does a better job than most educational children's shows. Oh, yeah? I gotta agree with that. Yeah. So should we all keep talking about Bluey? Yeah, it's a good idea, Sonic. All right, now. I found a place to sit, so. Yo. There we go. Now I can talk about Blue with y'all. All right. Hello there. Oh, God. What's wrong? I know who Sonic is talking about. And who would that be? That would be uh, someone we're not a huge fan of. That's... Ah, uh, yeah, Shinobu. Uh huh? Yeah, Shinobu Kocho. All she just does is just likes to, you know, tease people. But why? Well, I think it has to do with someone... Uh, we're not sure really why she teases, actually. Yeah, I don't get why she would tease us. I mean, she teased all of us first when we had no friends, actually. I mean, I personally didn't meet friends because I had Mario. Are you sure, Luigi? Because, you know, we might not be together forever. Mario, don't say something like that. Like, we're going to be together forever or something like that. All right, Luigi. We're brothers. Yeah, Mario. Oh, my God. Don't... It's like you're mentioning us that people are shipping us together. Wait, what? There exist ships of you together? Ah, do not ask that! <laughs> Probably you should not ask that. Ah, sorry, Luigi. <laughs> Man, I can't believe you would make someone like that cry. I know, I should not ask that. Well... Luigi, I wouldn't say that you and Mario would be together, you know? Just as brothers would two be good. You know, you're someone who understands me very well. Of course, I understand how people feel, even though I can't read facial expressions. Wait, does that mean... Wait, you're on the spectrum? Yeah, wait, how do you know? I had to guess, you know, because you said you couldn't read facial expressions. Well, I am on the spectrum, so how did you know I was on the spectrum? Oh, like I said earlier, like, remember how I told you I'm studying to be a doctor? Hmm, that is a fair reason how you knew I'm on the spectrum. Oh, I guess you could say that. Yeah, I have ASD, guys. Oh, as an autism spectrum disorder. Yep. Growing up, it was hard making friends. Oh, well, how come? Because I had difficulty with communication. I sometimes still avoid eye contact, though. Oh, Mal, it must have been really tough for you. It, it was, but as I got older, it somehow... I was able to manage it much quicker thanks to treatments. Oh, that's good. You took treatments to get it managed. Yeah, that sounds like you have a really great life now. I mean, the only best part I can think of is how I'm accommodated. Accommodated? Oh, it means that he gets some, like, I don't know how to say it. But does that mean you get, like, some extra stuff? Well, it depends on the scenario. Like, I need extended time. I need to take my test in a quiet area. And even have my test run out loud for me. Also, I need to send the phone just to listen better. Wow, those are all great commodities. Yeah, I know. I, I don't mean to brag about it and everything, but... Yeah. I also tend to have sensitivity. Wait, sensitivity to what? You know, like, certain sounds, smells, etc. Oh, yes. I heard about that. Since, remember, I'm a doctor, and I'm studying that. Yeah, yeah, I remember that, Mario. But how are we going to act now since... Shinobu, you said, uh, you know, you heard her voice. How are you gonna react now? Well, I don't know how to say that, personally. 
Yeah, I just don't know, really. Well, all I could say is that, you know, since she has never met you before, why don't you do it? Well, okay. Hopefully it goes well for you, Super Mario Studios. Yeah. Yeah. Duh. <laughs> Hello, how is everyone here? And who is this cute fellow? Um, okay, I could say. Yeah, I got to agree with that. I'm good. Yeah, I, I guess I could agree with that. Duh, huh? Yeah. Oh, my name is Simar Studios. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. My name is Shinobu Kocho. So, I gotta ask, what are you majoring? I'm majoring in pharmaceuticals. Wow. What about you? I'm majoring in linguistics, but I actually have a dream, which is to be a voice actor and a voice director. Mom. You know, I gotta ask. Why do you tease my new friends here? That's because half of these don't have any friends, and they remind me of Tomioka-san. I know, but how would you like it if somebody teased you? I guess not so good. So then why are you actually doing it? It's because of how I'm worried I might end up alone again. You know, there are way more respectable ways to become friends, right? Yes, I know. I'm sorry. I'll be your friend, though. What? Really? Wait, so my studios, why do you want to be friends with her? Because ever since I found out the reason why she teases people and how she's worried that she might not have more friends again, I feel kind of bad. Hmm, that does sound like a good thing, but she might do it again to you. Look, do you want her to have friends or not? Well, Super Series does have a point though, so I guess not. Alright? We'll all be friends with you. What? Really? Thank you. Yeah. And we'll also give you another chance as well. Alright. Thank you for giving another chance. I also really want to be your friends, though. I wish I could introduce you to them, but they're not here at the moment. Maybe another time? Oh, sure. Have yourselves a good day. Thanks. You too. Alright, I'll see y'all again. You know, Sumar Studios, you were able to change her. I did? Yeah, you were able to change her ways. I guess I never thought of it. What do you mean you never thought of it? You're supposed to say, I guess I didn't notice. Uh -huh. Yeah, I know. Sorry about that. Eh, it's okay. Well, is anyone up for some pizza? Oh yeah, pizza sure sounds fine. Yeah, Sonic, that's a good idea. I'm down for it. Is anyone up here down for it? Yeah! Duh, huh? Well, I'll see y'all there. Ow! Sonic, that was too fast. I gotta get going. Get the pizza. Oh, we're right behind you, Parappa. Hey, Luigi, come back here. Well, I better get going to get the pizza. We'll see you there, man. Well, Kazooie, it's time to fly, so let's go. There! Ah!